Directory Opus Pro, also known as Opus, is a file management application for PC and is highly customizable. What you see looks very different from the default configuration of Opus. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how I use Opus to view files and their metadata. Early on in a project, I separate files by type. If I open a folder with photos, certain columns are visible, or I can view thumbnails at several different sizes. Being able to access many different metadata fields is essential to an accurate and efficient workflow. If I select a file, I can open the metadata pane and or the preview pane to see more details. These are the columns I set as the default for looking at image files. If I need to see date metadata, I can choose a different folder format. I have installed an EXIF tool plugin for Opus, which allows me to view, filter, and sort by many different date metadata fields. Having different sets of columns visible when different file types are viewed is a customization I added to Opus. When I'm working with videos, I use a different set of columns. Since different video file formats use different date metadata fields, being able to see many helps me ensure video dates are correct. Now let's look at undated JPEGs and their metadata. I'll view them using a folder format that includes EXIF, XMP, and IPTC date columns. The combination of date metadata a photo has can indicate whether it is a scan, an illustration, or that it has simply been stripped of its date metadata. Using filters in Opus to find files with specific combinations of metadata and file properties helps me find things like video thumbnail images. To conclude this video about viewing files and their metadata in Opus, I'll quickly show you some of the columns available.